Jasmine here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So Black Friday was like a couple of weeks ago and I saw that Pretty Little Thing was having like a 70% off sale. Okay, so I um, always wanted to buy clothes from there and it's a UK brand and I want to try out like new clothes and everything and you know, why not try out a UK brand? And so I decided to um, pick up some stuff from there. Honestly, I'm pretty impressed. Okay, first I want to start out with the only um, non-pretty little thing clothing item that I'm going to be showing you guys in this haul. It's this leather jacket. Okay, so I didn't have a leather jacket before now and I'm surprised it took me this long to get one because <laughs> I love this jacket. It just like works with every single clothing piece in my wardrobe. It just spices it up. I'm going to be styling this piece with some of the clothes um, I got from Pretty Little Thing a little bit later. And this was from Nordstrom. And hold on, I got the receipt. Yeah, so the jacket was $57. And usually a, a jacket from Nordstrom. Oh, this is from Top Shop um, specifically. But usually their jackets are like starting at $100. So it's like basically 50-ish percent off. Okay, starting out with the first set I got from them. Uh, it's, oh, I didn't, <laughs> I wore this the other day and it's kind of inside out hold on all right so first it's this cute little off the shoulder top um it's kind of like a purplish gray color and it's ribbed um and so the top is, has this like little elastic band so it, you know stays up doesn't fall down or anything oh and with the sizing i'm always scared to like buy clothes from like places that i haven't shopped before and get all the clothes back and get all the clothes and none of it fit me. So when I choose my size at um, different brands like Pretty Little Thing, I look um, in the description of the item that I'm looking at and I um, look at the model's, model's height and then I, you know, I'm 5'5 five five, and so if this model is like 5'7 like, and I look at how the jeans fit her and like, okay, like I am kind of, I'm a little bit bigger than her but I'm like shorter than her so like, I, you know, I kind of um, think of it that way. So I'm thinking like, oh, so th since they are, you know, size zero, then I might be size two. So like, that's what I did. And it honestly worked out um, in the most part. And so, and I'm kind of happy that I looked and compared it and like saw what fit them. So like I can predict what fits me. This is a US four. Okay, so here are the matching bottoms. They are just long sweatpants. Um, well, they're joggers mostly. Yeah, they're joggers, sweatpants. Um, and they're the same color, the same material, stretchy, and um, the ribbed design on it. Unfortunately, this drawstring does not actually, like, do anything. It's just for show, which was, uh, like, actually kind of, like, eh. Like, I kind of wanted the drawstring to, like, actually work. This was, like, the only thing that I think I could have gotten a size down. This is also a US4. And I think I could have gotten a size down since this is so stretchy and these come up so high-waisted that like I have a really short tor torso and so like it was kind of like coming up to like right here <laughs> and so I like had to pull them down a little bit but they still work out. Now this outfit is the one that I was most excited for because you don't have to try it all with this because it's a two-piece set so once you put both of these on you already look like you have your life together because it's a, you know it's matching. And it's so comfortable and so it just you know looks like this I would say that there's a lot of like room here and I would rather have it more tight to especially my stomach area but like more baggy in the legs since they you know they are the jogger type of look um it's really comfortable the only thing is if you wear like a really colorful bra with this I feel like you would see it a little bit because it's a little little itty bitty 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 see-through and with these, again, I just wore my Fila shoes that look like this. The next item I got mainly for work, but since they're so comfortable, I'm probably going to wear them out of work. Um, they're these trousers. They're um, a bluish slash gray color with um, white and gray um, stripes. And they're not the usual, like, trouser material, you know, that, like, kind of silky-ish material that tra trousers are. This is kind of like a cottony type of, kind of like soft pants material, but not that soft. But actually, I don't mind it because first of all, you make your booty pop. <laughs> and they are so comfortable and it feels like you're wearing sweatpants instead of work pants. 
pockets. So that is a plus. And they have pockets, and they are nicely high-waisted on me. I also watched other people's videos on, like, what they got from Pretty Little Thing, and I, like, compared, like, oh, that fit them, okay, so that size fit them, so, like, you know, I think this size might fit me, uh, like, I was doing that type of thing. This outfit is for the people who want to look professional, but also want to be comfortable, and that is definitely what I strive to, to be. <laughs> and so... These pants are literally the comfiest thing. They're not see-through or anything. They pair nicely with a lot of tops since they are gray. And I paired it with this um, turtleneck from H&M. It's just black. And I also paired it with some um, Vans. These have been through a lot. I just wear these at work, so I just you know paired it with this. And it just works perfectly. You could um, jazz this outfit up with some heels. And also, if you're going to school and just like needed to look a little bit more professional than usual, then this is the outfit for you. <laughs> okay, the next thing is the only thing that I'm actually going to have to um, to switch in for a new size because um, it just is too small. But it's I'll still show you in the try on. It's not. It's just like uncomfortably small. You know, like I could still wear it, but it just like. I feel like this in the, when I'm wearing it, <laughs> so I'm definitely going to be getting a new size. Um, but it is this cute little top. Look at how cute it is. It's black with little polka dots, and it has these flared sleeves. Like, and it's cropped, as you can see. Um, I got it in a size US 2. Um, I'm definitely going to have to size up with this one. The next are some mom jeans. I'm a sucker for some mom jeans and if they have to be high-waisted, don't forget about that. <laughs> and so I, I didn't have a dark wash one. So here are some dark wash mom jeans. They have some big holes in them, um, but it's not too crazy. You know, I, some jeans like have like your entire leg showing. Like this is not that. It just has like chunks on the sides and like down by the ankle. They're really thick and nice material. Um, I got these in the US 4 and I am happy I did not go down a size because these, um, you know, they're a little bit snug when you get them on, but right when you get them like where they're supposed to be in your on your um, like stomach since they're high-waisted, it fits your stomach nicely which is so hard to find like sometimes like they always either fit my thighs or fit my waist like it's never both but these fit both and I'm so happy for it okay I'm putting these jeans on and this is not the actual outfit but I'm putting these jeans on and they're a little more snug than I thought they were going to be they're kind of really snug around this area but like fit really nicely around the waist so I don't know if I want to size up or not but yeah, here's the jeans. I will come back with the actual outfit in a second. Okay, so I paired the jeans with this top. Um, you probably can't really notice that it's kind of too small for me um, while I'm just wearing it because it like fits fine until like you raise your arms and this you know wants to go up all the way up your your waist. So you know that's annoying. And also, <laughs> I can't do any type of stretching. You know, can't really raise my hand in class or any of that without this moving where I do not want it to be. And I kind of love where these slits are. If you can if you can see this, the slit, I kind of like this. This is kind of like a dressy but casual type of look. I wear it to like a, a lunch. I'm definitely going to wear this soon. Okay, the last thing that I got from them are these um, corduroy pants that I'm wearing right now. This is what I wore to school today. This leather jacket that I bought from Nordstrom's and these pants paired with this white crop top. I honestly don't know where I got the white crop top from. It's from a while ago. Honestly, it looks like you tried really hard when you really didn't. Just because you slapped on a leather jacket and wearing corduroy, that's, <laughs> that's what it looks like and that is the look I'm going for. I paired it with these Fila shoes. Um, Oh, here they are. I can't really lift my leg because yes, these pants are a little tight. I don't think I should have went up a size because if I went up a size, they'd be way too big. I think it's just like how they're made. Um, but they fit really nicely and I, um, you know, they fit really nicely around everywhere, which is what I like. And when you sit down, you don't have that big gap 
when in the back of your jeans, if you know what I'm talking about. Okay, guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, and um, definitely comment down below if you tried any of Princess Polly's clothes, or, like, if you tried, like, a, um, one of, like, you know, the influencer brands, like, Fashion Nova, or, like, lounge um if you tried one of those and like tell me your story and if you liked it or not because i definitely want to try more of these brands that all of these influencers are trying out thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe down below and like this video i'll see you guys next time bye